Okay, so we're on this. Uh, I think it's a trail. I'm not really sure. Oh, oh no, 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 no. Morning, everybody. Welcome to another video. Today, we are going to hike up uh, Silver Peak. And um, the trail reports showed that uh, it is pretty overgrown uh, recently. So we're not really sure. We may have to come up with an alternate, uh, an alternate plan, maybe do a, another peak, but uh, not sure. But uh, right now, the goal is uh, Silver Peak. So let's go ahead and uh, get started. Oh, nice little creek. Excellent. Good way to start the hike. Okay, Cold Creek Trail, Pacific Crest Trail 2, Twin Lakes 1. Anyway, that's the trail we want to get to at Silver Peak. Great, already starting off with some wildflowers. We're on the trail, looking down into this uh, stream bed. Wow, some nice little wildflowers. And you can see the leaf structure right, right in, right in there. Okay. came to this really muddy area, but it was lined with these. Ah. Oops. Okay, we've got this flower right here does have kind of a lily-like leaves. Okay, this is a Devil's, Devil's Club, and I uh, haven't seen this in a really long time. It actually does, it actually is in the wildflower guide. That's these little tiny green flowers. It is a, just a nasty looking plant. Very formidable. And I get a closer look here, maybe at the spines. Maybe, yeah, there we go. We have a vanilla leaf. Here we have a huge patch of uh, that vanilla leaf. Yeah, and I've seen a lot of this recently. The boxwood. <laughs> I only point it out because uh, I've got it growing in my gardens at home, and uh, I'm just quite uh, quite amazed to find it out here. I don't know why. Yeah, even more, even more boxwood, <laughs> mountain boxwood. Okay, so we're just barely starting on the trail, and we've already seen some great wildflowers. So pro looking promising. Uh, okay, just stopping to take a break for a minute. I look at the forest. Okay, Mount Catherine Trail and Cold Creek. 
Creek Trail when we just came into this sign on. And we're going to take that trail right there. See the lake out there? I'll uh, kind of walk along here for a second. Just kind of taking the view of the lake. I think there's two lakes. Going to kind of just walk through this here. You, well, you could see Silver Peak up there, but it looks like it's kind of shrouded in the clouds. And uh, we are being eaten by mosquitoes in here. Of course, you know, in the subalpine forest, alpine in the western US, it's uh, not uncommon to uh, have mosquitoes buzzing you. Ooh, well, here we go. It's trails. It's trails. One of the rougher ones we've been on in a while. You okay? <sighs> so I want to get these uh, bluebells. Okay, we just have been coming through this salmonberry patch here. Oh. And here's even more of these bluebells. It's a huge patch of them. So we have this fog rolling down toward us. It's, it's, it's moving okay. Not real fast, but... Okay, we're not sure, but that plant up there with those yellow flowers, uh, we don't know if it's poison sumac or not. We've been hiking through it. Uh. Okay, I'm just gonna capture this going through here, ah, this trail. Oh man, caught my foot on a root down there. I'm trying not to touch these plants because we don't know if they're poisonous or not. Oh man. grabbing the plants but not today yeah here's a shot of the lake Okay, I don't know if that, those plants were poisonous. Uh, the way I went through back there, that looked like sumac. 
Uh, right now I don't have a rash or anything, so thank heavens for that, but that was a nasty piece of trail. <laughs> Cutting through that underbrush. <sighs> this one I think I've seen like a bad trail. I find one that's worse. But it's got, like I said, great views up here. Got this little uh, waterfall right here that we're going to cross. Finally, I'm on a real trail. Thank heavens. Here we have a Western Bleeding Heart. So we have these ferns here, kind of like a little fern garden. And uh, yeah, I um, just wanted to capture this. It's very lush looking. They're just in these rocks. Okay, there are these stairs that uh, look like they were uh, maybe put in place. Lacking a railing, but I will, uh, can't complain about that. Okay. All right, just wanted to kind of get that. Oh, we're getting more. More steep, dense stuff. It's very tiny. Oh, I'm stripping on my camera. It's very tiny. Check out the leaves. I don't want to stop too long. Okay, we've got these uh, scarlet columbine here. Looking a little, uh, maybe a little, a little war torn, a little tattered. Um, pretty good one over here. Okay, we just crossed that nasty scree field and then the log across the trail, I would get on my hands and knees and crawl into that thing. Looks like we're back on the trail again. Okay, so we're on this, I think it's a trail. I'm not really sure. Oh, oh no, 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 no. Okay, so this trail, it's like uh, we lost the trail, found the trail. If it is even, it's not much of a trail. And uh, this has been like really, really tough. Um, <laughs> I don't know what to say. We're like sweating and scratched and... But the good news is I don't think we're gonna see anybody. Cause you'd have to be totally crazy to drive in on this trail, to this trail and then actually hike it. There is a lot of them. Okay, seems like we've been in this forest forever. I think we're near the top. I think there's a saddle up there, so it should maybe it get easier? I don't know. Okay, it's like the 10th log, 12th log, something we climbed over. Yeah, one misstep and you're going like a bowling ball down the mountain. We're at the Pacific Crest Trail, right there. It can only get better from there. That's the trail we're on, right there. 
back through there coming up that steep mountainside I swear I think that was like I don't know it's up there in the like top three <laughs> worst uh I don't know hike slash scramble I've ever been on so but the good news is that trail looks well kept <laughs> Okay, got mosquitoes flying everywhere. I'm gonna capture that snowfield. And then uh, these big boulders here. Oh, there are mosquitoes everywhere. Got this nice little waterfall here. This nice little waterfall. Got the ferns going there. Here's a look at the trail. We just came down right across that uh, scree slope right there. And we've got uh, all these mountain bluebells. I think that's my stuff is valerian. Okay, look at this stream here. Wow. Once I cross, I'll take a look at it on the other side. Take another look. These plants right here. Oh. See the snow we're hiking along here. We can see the marks for the Pacific Crest Trail and see where my son fell through the snow lip. And then we're coming up on more of those flowers. Wow. I can really see their leaf shapes now. They look almost like violets. The leaves. They were trying to got a little lake right there. We're on the Pacific Crest Trail. And we're trying to figure out where the trail is uh, to go up Silver Peak. We've been traveling on the snow now for a while. <clears throat> These Avens, they just love the water. The snow melt. Wow. Let's see here. That looks like a good spot over there. There. Okay. okay. This trail, we left the Pacific Crest Trail. Now we're on the trail to get to the summit. But it's a lot like the trail we were on this morning. Extremely steep and rugged. My skills blinding me. So, anyway, let's keep going. The trail, this rock part of the trail 
and then it's kind of the view from where we're at right now some mountains out there in the clouds I think we want is right up there okay I'll catch my breath here so that sign I can't get any closer to it I get a little closer to it but it doesn't really matter I guess I'll just read it and it says no trespassing Cedar River watershed source of Seattle's water and that is I guess everything that direction you are another view it's opened up taking a break here Oh, still gotta go up there. Getting close though. Okay, there's the base on the top of the mountain. We're at the base. Just while we're hiking through. We've been on inland water like this for quite a while. Oh, well, okay, I almost bit. But it's very slick. This is trail. Have an arnica. And we have a his larkspur. And uh some mountain heather. And then uh this flocks right here, purple. Okay, we're navigating this talus slope here. And uh It looked like a trail from the top, but from here, I don't know. It doesn't really look like much. I guess it's kind of a trail. Okay, I think we're nearing the top. This field we came up was like incredibly steep. There's switchbacks. It's really hard to see the trail. That gives you an idea of how steep it is. See that orange down there? Those are avalanche lilies. I can't get too close to them. I guess I could, but I'm so tired. I don't want to hike back up. I see pen stemming down there. Two different kinds. Wow. Wow. 
This is very purple. They've got like these lance shaped leaves on them. It's quite the, quite the little flower garden up here. Okay, there's the top. Oh, I've got a ways to go. Pan around so I can take a break. Oh, man. Now there, there's a drop off right there. Wow. So we're hiking along. I've got black rock. Wow. Once again, it has this dizzying. Okay, just another look at the trail. give you an idea of what we're trying to climb up through here. <clears throat> My shadow's in the way, but there's nothing I can do about it. Matter of fact, it's the least of my concerns right now. Let's decide which way to go next. Okay. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to put the camera away. This is just uh, not gonna work. <clears throat> okay, we're taking a break somewhere near the summit. I think you can see the lake down there. I'll just turn it here. And then uh, we're coming over the top of this rock line here. Okay, I think we are at the summit here. Um, let me uh, find a way up. I'm really tired. That's not going to work. Okay, here we go. So, I'm gonna 
find my way, I think, up through here. Let me set the camera down for a second. No, no can now. <sighs> okay, let's see here. And then, uh, maybe. Move over here. Something right there. I got our stuff up there. Okay. That was great. Okay, I try to get these uh fence them in here. Ooh. They're just growing like right off the summit. Okay, and you can see the summit that I'm standing on. You can see my feet. Uh, go down that way. And then I think, yeah, there we go. Then we'll start, head our way down to the right of that blocky fault summit right there. <laughs> Which almost, it almost looks the same height as over here, so I don't know. Okay, I'm gonna do a 360 here. Just gonna pan around really slow. I have to watch my footing on this uh, on this uh, summit here. It's a kind of it's a, on a slant. Okay. And we'll do it one more time, just in case. Okay, here we go. This view, I think it's the best view I've ever seen. Bear with me as I turn. Okay, see down there, that is I-90. And out there, sort of in that, in that gap right there, that is, that is Bellevue and Seattle. There's that lake down there. Okay, well, I, uh, I'm gonna conclude this video Put everything away. Okay, we are on top of uh, Silver Peak. It was a long, it was long, it was really long to get up here, and um, it was like really, um, uh, it's really difficult. Like you know, literally like you know, two hands and two feet just to make it up here. I'm kind of worried about going down, so I'm uh, gonna put the camera away, and I'm just gonna focus on getting back to the car. <laughs> but uh, it's great, uh, great hike, long day, really hard. Um, great views from up here, it's just spectacular. Um, if you guys like this video, uh, be sure to give it a like. Um, otherwise, share and subscribe. And thanks for watching, and I will see you next time.